Um, yeah, that's right. You already know. Hold it up. Let them know. Um, great series of jumps today, man. You must be happy. Yeah, yeah, definitely. Um, I'm just happy to um, just be more consistent over 1380. I would have liked to get 14 today, but no, I'm really happy with where I am and where it's going. When you, um, which, which one of the, obviously the 1387 is the one that clinched it, but which one of the jumps did you feel really good on? Um, I think, I think, yeah, that last one and, and the second to last one as well. I just had that aggression and I really went for it. Um, so yeah, the, them two definitely were the ones. That been a busy season for you so far, even before the World Championship. So talk to me about how you kind of managed all of that load, because it's increasing, right? Yeah, no, it's definitely been probably my most difficult season because I had to hand in my uni dissertation. So that means I had to take some time off training. I've been competing more than I ever have. I've been training harder than I ever have. Um, and yeah, I think I've been reaping the results. Although I've not, not jumped to 14, but I know that I'm improving and I'm, high, I'm more consistent than I was last year. So just building on that, I'm just really confident going forward now. What type of athlete are you? Do you, is the pressure on your shoulders enough or do you need competition out there to I ask that because obviously I talk to Christian Taylor a lot and he thrives yeah. on that competition out there that's what helps him to produce the big long jumps yeah. are you like that or are you just you don't need that no I think I'm definitely like that I think the difference between this and indoors is that Laura Samuel was there and indoors I got pushed into second and then that just gave me that extra energy to go over 14 and she's not competed all season so it's been me kind of pushing myself and it's amazing to see the other girl jump PVs and stuff but um, having that competition is just especially on British soil it's just a different feeling so yeah hopefully then it can kind of come up again but I'm just gonna have to learn to push myself and compete against myself really the prep for the world championships obviously gone great what do you do now in the closing weeks um, yeah, just keep training hard and I might have a couple more competitions to do as well. But yeah, just keep doing what I'm doing and try and have that aggression going forward. Thanks for your time, well done. <laughs> Thank you.